So let's uh, start with Blood Wars. Y your excitement coming into this project now that it's a couple movies in and you're taking over uh, and taking that mantle. Yeah, no, I mean, it's it has been super exciting. And um, there's so much uh, new characters and so much new stuff coming in this in this uh, story that it's, you know, it's it's definitely uh, it's just taking it to a whole to a whole different level. I mean, there will be more lichens in, as count lichen count than ever. And but I think as well, there is more and deeper story than there has been before. Now you also are associated with my wife's favorite show. She's streaming the heck out of it with Outlander. <laughs> now you're coming into this, which is one of my favorite franchises. What's that like being involved in two super popular things at the same time? Look, uh, the interesting thing about Outlander is uh, it's very, very character driven and there is some rather um, complex and difficult material, especially um, the, you know, the season finale we did uh, with Tobias Menzies, who we brought to, uh, to Underworld. Um, now, look, I think it's great because um, the action and all the, yeah, you know, wire work and everything, and as well, like, let's say, the visual scope on, on uh, Underworld is one aspect, but the aspect that's really super exciting for me is working with actors on, on real uh, performances and real, um, you know, the story, basically. So I think, um, yes, it's two different things, but in a way it has, it has um, much to do with each other in terms of approach. Now you mentioned Tobias, was your relationship from Outlander an easy way to sell him on this project absolutely. or was he already excited about it? No, absolutely. I mean, we uh, we did those two uh, last episodes of the season finale that were, you know, quite uh, intense um, material. And I think we developed a kind of trust in terms of uh, the way we work. Uh, and so, no, I thought it was a was a pretty clear decision to do this uh, underworld together. Now you're taking over this franchise. Are we, should we expect the same visual elements, the same kind of flow to the story that we've seen in the other underworlds or are you going to kind of give it your own spin on it? Look, I think it's always important to anything that you're taking over because it's a franchise and it has fans and it has something established that you're taking this uh, and you're building on it. So I, I don't, I never intended to do something completely different, but I do think it will be, um, it will have a different spin on it for sure. Excellent. Thank you very much.